righty, so uh, here in the country I'm born in, uh, we have our outlets polarized, and uh, we have a tester to check them for polarity, and I'll show you what it does. You can see on the chart there what the lights mean. Okay, so I took this uh, lamp light socket here and I hooked it up backwards to simulate that a receptacle is hooked up backwards. And I'll show you why we polarize our stuff here in the country I'm born in, in the United States. I'm going to take this neon bulb, hold this side. You can see that little glow inside that bulb. That little neon light just starting to glow a little bit. That means that is live. So if I were to touch this part of the socket and something grounded, I would get a shock. But the light would still work when you screw it in. And on the uh, your outlets and extension cords, one slot is wider than the other. The wider one is always the neutral, and the narrower one is always the live wire. So if you have like a lamp and has a polarized plug on it, and you uh, have an outlet that's hooked up backwards, and the bulb blows and you screw in, screw in a new bulb, and you happen to touch that metal base there while it's just starting to be screwed in, you'll uh, make yourself live. So if you touch something grounded, you would also get a shock. Okay, so I unplugged the light. So uh, if you look on the back of the light fixture, one side is brass and one side is silver. The brass always gets the uh, live wire and the silver always gets the neutral wire. That's uh, true with uh, outlets also. Uh, before you do any electrical work, always consult with a uh, certified electrician. Peace. Thanks for watching.